It is a nice park. It has a playground for kids and picnic tables. But neighbors who live near the park say there's no way they'll take their kids there. News 13's Gabrielle Burkhardt is live near Carlisle in San Mateo with a rare inside look at the problem. Gabby. Jessica Dean, the city cleaned up trash at Bel Air Park here yesterday, but neighbors say that doesn't fix the bigger problem, a problem that starts with a group of people who've been sleeping here. From a distance, Bel Air Park near Carlisle and Manal looks inviting. It's been a beautiful park. But walk a little closer. Right next to an empty playground sits an empty liquor bottle, and it's apparent someone has moved in. It just seems like since this warm weather's hit, that the uh, homeless have just taken over that whole west end of the park. Mike Bertetto says that's just the beginning. He and other neighbors claim the park is getting trashed. There are sleeping bags, full shopping carts overturned, homeless sleeping on picnic tables. Our camera spotted people passed out and just waking up in the middle of the day. But for those who live near the park, the biggest concern is crime. It's scary, it is. Sadly that they don't have anywhere to go, but a lot of them are too busy putting junk in their arm and, and drinking and alcoholics and, and, and don't choose to get help. That's what neighbors say they've seen. One neighbor snapped these photos of someone in the park with what appears to be a needle in his arm. Here's another. This man tells us he's been staying here. This is how I wound up. We talked for a while and told him about local resources. I want to ask him help, but then I don't want to. We have our outreach teams. You know, the city provides so many services, especially through 311, but we can't make them take them. Unless they're caught committing a crime, city officials say the homeless have every right to be here during park hours. We came back last night to check things out and spotted an ambulance, police, and fire crews. Officers say it was an alcohol related medical call. I don't know what the answer is. I know we're all tired of it in the Bel Air District. Albuquerque police say the area command for this park is working on a tact plan to tackle crime here. APD also says there will be extra patrols in this area. Back to you. All right, thank you, Gabrielle. After we inquired about this problem, police say they've put in a request to place their mobile surveillance cameras in the park at some point.